than the national record holder, Llewellyn Herbert. He goes in lane five. Herbert, a man who's run inside 49 seconds on 29 occasions, and he's still just 22. But look out for the athlete in lane four, Henny Borta. He's getting better and better with every race. Ten flights of hurdles. The gap between each 35 metres. 45 metre run for the first. And it's Henny Borda who rises first just in front of Herbert. But Herbert, of course, we know, is a very strong finisher. And going down the back straight, well, Henny Borda's got about a metre at the moment on Llewellyn Herbert, though Herbert just getting back there. This is the fifth hurdle. And Herbert and, and uh, Borta rise together. Also going well, Ferenc Peter, a former national champion. And also Billy Smith going well on the outside. And also coming through on the inside, well, though, we see Borta. And Porter and Herbert are going to rise together at the eighth. What a race this is. Herbert just landing a little awkwardly there. Missing his stride pattern. And Henny Porter. And Llewellyn Herbert has nothing to choose. Can Porter take it? And Herbert is fighting back. But I think Porter's going to take it. What a win for Henny Porter. The time, 49.03. That is a lifetime best. It's an Olympic qualifying standard. And Sydney, that was also quite a shock. Well, Henny Borda took it to Llewellyn Herbert this time. You could see from hurdle number three that Henny Borda was running a totally different race. This was not the old Llewellyn Herbert as we know it, as when he came across over the line over the last 110 meters or so. He just couldn't hang in there. Well, I sincerely hope we're going to send two 400 meter hurdlers at least to the Olympic Games. It's only really the United States who sends athletes who can run about 49 seconds and can't get to send them to the Olympics because they've got more than three who can run that fast. But Henny Borta, another significant breakthrough for this man, 49.03. And that, for me, is the performance of the night. Phoebe, for your test, Kana, and Bruno, for sure, for Lewell and Herbert. I can't tell you how many years I've been here for the last 100 meters. Zonder hem denk ik was alles onmogelijk vanavond. En dan met Thijs Kade, wauw. Toen ik eigenlijk acht uur ging, toen leek het tussen toets. Rak bij toets en het was raar wonderlijk. Weet je, het maakt André alleen een beetje gepompt. En het was wonderlijk. Ik heb een baie goed gevoel, net ontspan. En ik moet weer die krediet van Luelle nog geven. Weet je, hij heeft me baie deur getrekt. En het is lekker voor mij om samen om te hartelijk. Hij is een baie goeie atleet. Hij is niet van niet nummer twee in die wereld. Nie. En uh, ik weet, hij is nog in het begin van het seizoen. Maar het is lekker om samen om te hartelijk. Uh, ik hoop dat ik ga samen de Olympische Spelen doen. We zullen maar zien hoe het verder in seizoen is. Waar je blij? The next big barrier for Henny Borta will be to go below 49, and that really will put him in the world class bracket. But for tonight, it's the scalp and the scalp of Llewellyn Herbert. 49.22 for Herbert, not at his best. Zadislav Shuria gets below 49 and a half seconds, and that was a world class 400 meter hurdle race. Well, I said I thought this was the performance of the night, and at least the judges seem to agree with me on this one. Henny Borta catching the well and Herbert. What a scalp that was to pick up. And really, I think we found ourselves another world-class athlete.